A mom suspended from her job after she became possessed and offered sex at a work Christmas party says she was spiked by injection. Michelle Hosking, 42, is now the subject of a gross misconduct investigation and has been temporarily dismissed from her duties as a health and safety advisor of Bourneville Village Trust, where she has worked for 15 months. The single mum of two allegedly switched before colleagues, who accused her of propositioning them for sex and suddenly becoming mental and possessed. But Michelle insists she was spiked, claiming she discovered a visible pinprick and developed a huge bruise after the work due on December 10 in Birmingham. City Center, Stoke-on-Trent Live reports. After losing hours of her memory from the party, Michelle reported the spiking incident to West Midlands Police and attended hospital the following day. Michelle believes she was spiked in the street as she walked to the Christmas party, image, Nick Wilkinson, BPM Media. But three days later, the mum was suspended from her role as the trust launched an ongoing probe and said it took the allegations of spiking and misconduct. Very seriously. Michelle said. I used to love working for them but the way they have treated me is horrendous. I can understand how these other girls are feeling because you don't expect it to happen to you and when it does, no one's there for you and the people. That do, the injecting, don't understand what happens behind the scenes. I am a single mum I've got two children, I've got a mortgage to pay. If the spiking is for laughs, it's for laughs but it's not for the people that are involved in it. I keep having to ring up and ask the question to my employer and they say it's still under investigation. It's nearly three months now and obviously the mental health impacts of that as well as everything that happened before, it's horrendous. Michelle can remember eating her starter and having a glass of wine before three more tiny drinks. She then claims she lost four hours after she was spiked walking from the old joint stock pub to the main venue, the Clayton Hotel. She said, I do believe I was spiked by injection. Unfortunately, my employers have taken a very dim view of it and I've been suspended on full pay ever. I remember eating my starter then I've lost four hours, she continued. I just don't remember. The witness statements say that I was being aggressive, waving my arms around, I was possessed, I was mental, I was psychotic and I have no recollection of this at all. It's almost like a switch was flicked, it's gone. There's nothing there at all, I have no recollection at all. They said I was acting crazy, mental, possessed. Allegedly, obviously I don't remember any of this, allegedly I punched a colleague, I propositioned a few people for sexual relations, I was in a relationship at the time so I can't understand why that would happen. The mum says the allegations against her are horrendous, image, Nick Wilkinson, BPM Media. Most read. Princess Charlotte's sassy response when an aide tried to help her with a special gift. Elon Musk responds to Ukrainian plea for help by activating Starlink satellites. Ukraine's sailor tries to sink his Russian boss £5 million luxury yacht and has no regrets. Michelle's next memory is getting home at 6.15pm, when she rang colleagues in a confusion over what had taken place and why she was back at her house so early on into the festivities. She said, something wasn't quite right, I rang a couple of colleagues and said, what happened? A couple of colleagues brought me home in a taxi. Michelle described the following months as horrendous as she claimed colleagues had been told not to speak to her, leaving her completely and utterly. The last three months have been awful. I haven't heard from my line manager since the December 13th when he suspended me, no duty of care was carried out. It's been horrendous. I had a massive bruise on my thigh. You can see the pinprick marking my leg in the photo. On Tuesday afterwards, I went to the hospital as my sister. Saidishi didn't like how the bruise was spreading. Michelle has hit out at the offenders using needles to spike revelers as she spoke of the impact on her mental health. She said, I don't think people understand the actual impact that something like that can have. I am just a normal mum, I take my kids to school and go to work and then this happens and your whole world implodes but people don't understand it's really hard. It has really affected my mental health. I was on antidepressants for anxiety before this, so the fact that I've had no communication is just exacerbating. The last time I spoke to them was two weeks today at the disciplinary hearing. They did actually apologize to me for not providing me with that care. 
I don't know what's going on, no one has rang me. Bourneville Village Trust said it takes both reports that a colleague has been harmed and accusations of misconduct very seriously as it said investigations take time to complete. The trust said it could not comment on the individual circumstances, but offer support and regular contact through investigations. Helen Harvey, director of People and Performance at Bourneville Village Trust, said, the health and safety of our colleagues is very important to us in any reports that a colleague has been harmed in any way are taken very seriously and treated sensitively. We also take accusations of misconduct extremely seriously and they are investigated thoroughly and carefully to ensure colleagues are treated with fairness in similar articles to this. Student's terrifying ordeal of waking up in hospital after being spiked on night out. Club had security measures in place when three clubbers spiked by injection. 5. Comments. EastEnders J. Brown actor reveals he lives with crippling phobia of throwing up. Trigger points burning questions as most explosive episode yet airs on ITV. 1. Comments. Tourist, 25, temporarily paralyzed after eating marijuana brownie in Amsterdam. 5. Comments. I quit my job as a cop to join OnlyFans, viewers love my handcuffs and gun. 4. Comments. Girl thought ribcage lump was ice skating injury until she finally had it checked. 2. Comments. Mom who knew son wouldn't get old says he was failed by support network. Maura Higgins fears she's lost a stone as she's bed bound for days by mystery illness. 12. Comments. Arthur Labinjo Hughes murder. Report says urgent action needed to protect more kids. 13. Comments. Prince Andrew found 12 million pounds to escape a court case. Why aren't police as curious as we are? ABC frontman Martin Fry shares how he's an old romantic, but his wife disagrees. 3. Comments. Students' terrifying ordeal of waking up in hospital after being spiked on night out. Club had security measures in place when three clubbers spiked by injection. 5. Comments. EastEnders J. Brown actor reveals he lives with crippling phobia of throwing up. Trigger points burning questions as most explosive episode yet airs on ITV. 1. Comments. Tourist, 25, temporarily paralyzed after eating marijuana brownie in Amsterdam. 5. Comments. I quit my job as a cop to join OnlyFans, viewers love my handcuffs and gun. 4. Comments. Girl thought ribcage lump was ice skating injury until she finally had it checked. 2. Comments. Mom who knew son wouldn't get old says he was failed by support network. Maura Higgins fears she's lost a stone as she's bed bound for days by mystery illness. 12. Comments. Arthur Labinjo Hughes murder. Report says urgent action needed to protect more kids. 13. Comments. Prince Andrew found 12 million pounds to escape a court case. Why aren't police as curious as we are? ABC frontman Martin Fry shares how he's an old romantic, but his wife disagrees. 3. Comments. Students' terrifying ordeal of waking up in hospital after being spiked on night out. Club had security measures in place when three clubbers spiked by injection. 5. Comments. EastEnders J. Brown actor reveals he lives with crippling phobia of throwing up. Trigger points burning questions as most explosive episode yet airs on ITV. 1. Comments. Tourist, 25, temporarily paralyzed after eating marijuana brownie in Amsterdam. 5. Comments. I quit my job as a cop to join OnlyFans, viewers love my handcuffs and gun. 4. Comments. Girl thought ribcage lump was ice skating injury until she finally had it checked. 2. Comments. Mom who knew son wouldn't get old says he was failed by support network. Maura Higgins fears she's lost a stone as she's bed bound for days by mystery illness. 12. Comments. Arthur Labinjo Hughes murder. Report says urgent action needed to protect more kids. 13. Comments. Prince Andrew found 12 million pounds to escape a court case. Why aren't police as curious as we are? ABC frontman Martin Fry shares how he's an old romantic, but his wife disagrees. 3. Comments. Students terrifying ordeal of waking up in hospital after being spiked on night out. Club had security measures in place when three clubbers spiked by injection. 
5. Comments. EastEnders J. Brown actor reveals he lives with crippling phobia of throwing up. Trigger points burning questions as most explosive episode yet airs on ITV. 1. Comments. Tourist, 25, temporarily paralyzed after eating marijuana brownie in Amsterdam. 5. Comments. I quit my job as a cop to join OnlyFans, viewers love my handcuffs and gun. 4. Comments. Girl thought ribcage lump was ice skating injury until she finally had it checked. 2. Comments. Mom who knew son wouldn't get old says he was failed by support network. Maura Higgins fears she's lost a stone as she's bed bound for days by mystery illness. 12. Comments. Arthur Labinjo Hughes murder. Report says urgent action needed to protect more kids. 13. Comments. Prince Andrew found 12 million pounds to escape a court case. Why aren't police as curious as we are? ABC frontman Martin Fry shares how he's an old romantic, but his wife disagrees. 3. Comments. Students terrifying ordeal of waking up in hospital after being spiked on night out. Club had security measures in place when three clubbers spiked by injection. 5. Comments. EastEnders J. Brown actor reveals he lives with crippling phobia of throwing up. Trigger points burning questions as most explosive episode yet airs on ITV. 1. Comments. Tourist, 25, temporarily paralyzed after eating marijuana brownie in Amsterdam. 5. Comments. I quit my job as a cop to join OnlyFans, viewers love my handcuffs and gun. 4. Comments. Girl thought ribcage lump was ice skating injury until she finally had it checked. 2. Comments. Mom who knew son wouldn't get old says he was failed by support network. Maura Higgins fears she's lost a stone as she's bed bound for days by mystery illness. 12. Comments. Arthur Labinjo Hughes murder. Report says urgent action needed to protect more kids. 13. Comments. Prince Andrew found 12 million pounds to escape a court case. Why aren't police as curious as we are? ABC frontman Martin Fry shares how he's an old romantic, but his wife disagrees. 3. Comments. Powered by. This means that investigations can take time to complete whilst all evidence is gathered and reviewed. During an investigation, colleagues are offered support and regular contact throughout. As our investigation process is confidential we are unable to comment on individual cases. West Midlands Police said in a statement, our investigation into this crime closed after all lines of enquiry were exhausted. If new information is received that would help us identify the person responsible, we are ready to reopen the case. Read more. Brits stuck in Ukraine after collecting surrogate twins they waited 13 years for. Read more. Inside Peter Andre's 49th birthday as he gets unbelievable surprise from Emily and kids.